Welcome back to KSJ2. We have some breaking news coming out from downtown tonight. It appears a dead body has been discovered around the local industrial complex and Camus Road. We have Alex Minoko at the scene live. Alex, what can you tell us so far? Hello, Sim, yes. Police have yet to identify the man found stabbed to death in this abandoned warehouse. And this is the second murder that's happened in this area in the past two months. Police Chief Morgan has advised that all local residents stay indoors during late night hours until they can capture the suspected murderer. Hey, isn't that like three blocks away from here? Yeah, I know that place. I walk by there every day to the bus stopped. Hey, what do you think about this match? I got it on Tinder. Oh no, you can do way better than that, Tracy. Come on now. Shh, watch. Authorities have now identified the body found at the scene of that of 20-year-old Jack Johnson. They've also identified a potential suspect in the case and would like anyone to report any information. Hey, Kathy, I was watching that. Guys, being at home is so boring. We should do something fun. Hey, let's check out the crime scene. What? Did you just hear what was going on with the news? Well, there's nothing, there's nothing to do at home. Just go check it out for a bit. Yeah, I'm down for it. Haha, ha, very funny, guys. There's no way you could get me to go. Yeah, we just want to go take a look at this place. It won't be long. There's no turning back now. killings which were located on the industrial complex. Two young women named Jessica Medina and Tracy Tagged have been killed in the same exact warehouse where Jack Johnson was murdered two days ago. Police were frantically searching for their main suspect named Kathy Nguyen. She has been connected to multiple killings in the past month. Well, will we ever find out why she decided to kill her best friends and two other men? Only time will tell.